Hi, I'm Paul Brigner. I'm the Managing Director of the Blockchain Technology and Ecosystem Design Research Center here at Georgetown University. And today I am interviewing three Space Chain executives. So gentlemen, would you please introduce yourselves for us? Hi, uh, I'm Zi Jen. I'm the co-founder and CEO of Space Chain. So uh, before I started this initiative, I studied at Columbia University. And uh, after my first uh, company exit, and I started this, comp uh, started this uh, initiative a year ago. My name is Matt Rozak. Uh, so I'm on the uh, board of advisors of Space Chain. Uh, my background has been in uh, uh, technology, investing, and entrepreneurship my entire career. So uh, I've been a venture investor, started five enterprise software companies. Uh, got into blockchain about uh, six years ago. I'm uh, Jeff Garzik. I'm the uh, CTO and co-founder of Space Chain. Uh, and uh, I guess a big blockchain nerd. I uh, have been in blockchain since uh, almost the beginning. I worked with Satoshi Nakamoto on the original blockchain Bitcoin. And uh, before that, uh, worked uh, 20 years in the Linux industry under Linus Torvald. So I like to, I like to bring uh, the technology smarts to what is a, a world impactful, world changing project. The goal of Space Chain is actually to integrate blockchain technology and space technology together to lower the barrier of entry for the space industry and provide more opportunity to uh, like everyday people to participate and also contribute to space projects. Space Chain has this very unique opportunity to uh, not only uh, think about building the, the hardware, the software, and the applications, but also this community that's uh, been, been very interested and doing these types of things, but it hasn't had a medium to do that. And so Space Chain is, is uh, developing and creating that medium to, uh, to innovate in outer space. We have skilled aerospace engineers, skilled blockchain engineers spread out all over the world. We have spacecraft in orbit today which uh, distinguishes us not only from uh, most of the blockchain industry, but quite frankly, most of the space industry as well, is uh, you'd be surprised at how few space startups have actually made it to space. We're building this decentralized network. We're building a constellation of satellites that are going to communicate with each other. But at an economic level, we're looking to engage the community. We're looking to think to ourselves, how can we incentivize a business, a university student, an explorer, an experimenter to participate in this new economy? And so that's why we're blockchain-based. That's why we're, we have a token. That's why uh, we feel that blockchain is so transformative and the marriage of blockchain and space makes so much sense. It's really amazing the scope and the breadth of what you're doing. And uh, you started this about a little over a year ago. We've developed a uh, space chain operating system. This is the software that actually runs on the spacecraft called Space Chain OS. Uh, over 1.3 million lines of code have uh, been uh, open sourced, open to the community. And uh, we're running that in space. It is flight proven, which is a uh, very tough standard to meet. We're doing something that's never been done before on a satellite, is traditionally if you want to deploy a space app, then you're paying many millions of dollars. You're going to be the owner of a singular satellite that goes up and executes your space application. Now that's obviously very cumbersome, very expensive, out of reach of everyone except governments and uh, uh, companies. But what Space Chain is doing is we've created a platform just like your mobile device that you can load many apps onto one device. That's something that we do every day, but it's totally new to space. Since blockchain is a high security environment based on cryptography, it creates a high security environment in space for us, for free. So we load, as you call it, terrestrial blockchain software onto our satellites, which are orbiting as we record this today. And we, that enables multi-tenant use of a single satellite. That's totally new in the satellite industry. So this multi-tenant satellite uh, form factor and platform is something that we feel is going to democratize access to space. It's going to take the, the access cost from millions of dollars to a couple bucks. The focus is not only just building out the tech and uh, the hardware with the satellites, the, uh, the blockchain and, and connectors for APIs and, and applications, uh, that's part one. A big part of it is that community engagement because 
uh, it's going to take a lot of entrepreneurs and technologists and visionaries to uh, be inspired by what we're building and actually help uh, with this kind of invisible hand, uh, get as many satellites up there, test and uh, uh, experiment with new applications. And so we're focused uh, equally on building that community. So uh, we're members of uh, the Chamber of Digital Commerce, uh, Enterprise Ethereum Alliance, uh, every uh, component in the blockchain space. We already talked about the first satellite going up, running a blockchain node. I know you have other plans. What's coming next? More satellites? We have uh, two launching plans this year, uh, before the end of this year. Hopefully we can launch uh, on one on uh, September. Well, the payload will be up there on September and one launch on December. Another uh, main objective is that we already upload our open source uh, code on GitHub. So it's uh, Space Channel OS. Uh, we want to promote the open source uh, like uh, to the developer community and having more people uh, test it out and uh, build their application on our, our platform. So uh, like uh, if so, we're going to continue to build the technology, build our uh, the trust with the community. And uh, we believe, you know, the value of the project will be, you know, like uh, I think it will distinguish itself because uh, as Jeff said, we have a 1.3 million of codes open source, we have a satellite is already there, we have a launching plan. We believe what we do is a very unique and uh, uh, we will own our own place as the whole market.